The birth of a child with birth defects is a tragic and traumatic experience for everybody concerned. The questions as to whether the defect could have been detected during the pregnancy, was caused by negligence during the birthing process, or was not reasonably detectable or was unavoidable, is an area of inquiry most generally to be dealt with under the legal guidance associated with the law relating to medical malpractice. Generally, there is no legal liability for the doctors or healthcare providers if during the pregnancy and the delivery process, the level of medical care was consistent with accepted community standards relating to such medical practices. To make a determination as to whether the problem is the result of medical malpractice, a review of all medical records of the mother and the child during the pregnancy is required. That review will be carried out by board-certified medical specialists in obstetrics as a general rule. Other board-certified doctors may also be involved depending upon the defect detected in the newborn. If the reviewing specialists will provide an affidavit that indicates malpractice on the part of the treating physicians and healthcare providers, and if there is evidence that this malpractice caused the defect, a legal claim may be justified. Issues such as the failure to warn the mother of the risks associated with pregnancy based upon her or her husband's medical history are also subject to investigation, but the recovery of damages in such cases is far less certain. All of the special rules, including a limited statute of limitations, provisions of payment of attorney's fees and costs if the defense prevails, and limitations on available damages are also involved in these types of cases. The lawyers at Carlson, Meissner, Hart, and Hazlett have experience in the review and evaluation of birth defect and injury claims. For close to 40 years, our lawyers have helped parents in Pinellas, Hillsboro, Manatee, Pasco, Hernando, and Citrus counties in Florida reach informed conclusions about the filing of a medical malpractice lawsuit in such cases. Carlson, Meisner, Hart, and Hazlett, serving the community since 1971.